Well, hello everyone, how are all you guys doing today? I hope you guys are all doing well. This is Arcane, and welcome to some more of The Last of Us multiplayer here on the Water Tower. And um, in this game, I want to share with you my loadout, which I personally think is one of the best loadouts ever, seriously. Um, I'm not going to say I came up with this loadout. Somebody might have come up with it before. I'm not going to claim it to be my person, like claim I created this thing, but I did put it together myself and um after having a few games with it which is which went really really well i um decided to share it with um bobby box on his subscriber loadout um challenge that he does so you might even see it on there too but to share with you what the loader actually is, it is um, the Silence Shorty. It's then no um, large firearm. We then use Covert Training 3, um, Agility 2, and Sharp Ears 3. So let's first talk about the Sharp Ears 3 and Agility 2. As we all know, that is a beautiful combination to glide around the map in such stealthy style. And obviously we then have Covert Training 3 which allows us to do that even more because we can't even be marked as well. And then on top of that we're going to back things up with the Silent Shorty so nobody knows where we are if we just cruise and crouch like we are doing now. And um, what I really really like about this loadout is it really works well as a shiv loadout as well. If you um, craft a couple of shivs, um, you can go around shiving, use the shorty as backup. And it's just a really awesome loadout. I find it to work well in random lobbies versus party lobbies. As you know, in party lobbies, they tend to be much more experienced, played the game quite a lot of the time, and um, they know all the spots in the maps and stuff, so it is harder to sneak around. Um, stealthily in party lobbies but that's just my experience but may not be with you but in random lobbies trust me really give this loadout a go it is really really good and um, I will just I'll pause a bit a little bit there because my video was skipping and I'm having really bad luck with this um, commentary today yesterday I tried to do this commentary twice first I forgot to hit the record and did an eight minute commentary stupid I know the second time I forgot to turn the mic on my turtle beach so I gave it up as a bad job I've started today in the first two times again the commentary has paused and I had to start over and now I was getting a little bit of skipping or lag on the video itself, but the commentary seems to be going okay. I don't know what happens. I don't know why this game is giving me back that bad look. I, it cannot be the hate for the shorty that much, seriously, that I get bad look over the past two days. Anyway, so we got, I go for the assist there, but end up getting the down. And um, I do get the revive as well. So this guy is not going to have any luck with... Um, getting downs because he he gets down once there and then i think he somehow runs into a bomb over here he tries to take out that bomb and ends up dying from another bomb so i've got to um go there help him get down again i tried to sort that bomb out first but i fail i then go in for the revive and i fail because i do see an incoming molotov so i'm gonna put one more bullet in my shorty go for the one shot he's got a tactical shotgun i think but i'm gonna win the battle i am gonna win the battle there shorty versus tacky shorty wins go shorty and then we're gonna sort this bomb out i actually do like blowing up bombs with the shorty because you can blow it off from quite a distance and um, without getting damaged um i did get manage to get damaged there though and this guy he's down and i thought what i would do is use him as bait to um get that second um, opponent in there but he um i think he saw me so he backed off so i'm just gonna back off now he's dead i can go pick up my parcel later so here we're gonna craft a shiv so i get one shiv and an extra shiv and that is gonna come into some real use in a minute as you can see and in the meantime, pick up my parts here. So I'm doing very well on the supplies. My clan will be very healthy indeed. They're all going to get a can of their bank beans or whatever, they, whatever was in there. I don't know. So that guy had a Molotov. So I don't want to go anywhere near him because I'm end up going to get flipping blown up. So I'm just going to come to this box here. And let me see, move this audio to the side here. Yeah. I'm going to come to the box. Now we do have 10 minutes 11 on the clock so we're doing pretty well. 16 spawns to 11. My teammate gets down here. I wanted to move in quicker but I saw another red dot on the map so I wasn't too sure who was where at that point so I thought I'll just wait a little bit and that allows me to get one shiv kill 
And then my teammate struggling here, but second so I'm gonna move in. Soon as I see him where, where he is on the map, I run in, but it's too late for him, but I managed to get the second shiv kill in there. So I um, get a double shiv and my shivs have run out. Which is really funny because I didn't notice that, um, as you're going to see later on in the game. And I just noticed now I put my um, shorty to full upgrade, which I haven't. I don't know why I hadn't done that um, earlier on in the game. I know I do like to collect parts and stuff, but I am only using the shorty, so I should have done that earlier. And armor, armors are really frustrating um, to purchase for me because... Um, Oh, I always use it and it never seems to work for me, whereas when someone else has got it on, it always seems to work wonders for them. I, I mind just end up getting blown up by an arrow or a hunting rifle and it just annoys the hell out of me. I do have loads of parts to waste on armor today though, so I just might do that. So we got a guy over here. So we got a guy over here with armor. I've got armor. Armor versus armor. One hit with the shorty. One hit with the stick. Takes the guy down. And um, someone's firing at me here, so I need to back off. So I did think that I could use him as bait again, but the guy firing at me, he knows I'm clearly around here. Um, I think this guy is going to bleed out. He's not going to be saved. And there's two enemies just nearby, so I'm going to hang around here. I thought they might come to this supply box. Now, my teammates are pushing um, right. So that's going to force them to come left unless they're going to battle. So I'm going to hang around here and... Um, am I going to put some more armor on? No, I'm going to buy two more bullets. Oh. And then I'm just going to hang around here to see if they um, fight my teammates. If they do, I can go in behind them and um, get some flank going there. And if they come this way, I can hang around. I really, really do like Water Tower. It's a really awesome map. One of the best DLC maps. So now that these two are on this side of the map, and I'm kind of flanking these guys now, um, my teammates nicely gets one down there so the other guy's gonna back off behind the tree what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna rush in there and i here is where i actually thought i had a shiv and i'm gonna try run around him to get a shiv kill he's in his backpack so i hit him twice with my stick and i i know i am against one mollies like that which i do waste as well but i have actually realized that i'm not dead yet um, during the game and i wanted to try and survive there but my teammate saves me so i'm very grateful thank you very much teammate and we've got 7 minutes 16, no, 7 minutes 16 on the clock, yeah, that's correct. And, well, what's that guy doing? So I'm going to rush this guy with the molly. One, and he's got one more, oh, and he's down. Now, he does actually drop a bomb, which is a very sneaky and a good tactic to do, but I do see that. And he actually cr crawls down with his bomb to the end of the wall. You're going to see it there, because I go get my parts, um, and he's got his bomb over it, which is quite funny. So I thought that was pretty hilarious, as you can see here, his bomb, which... I don't think I marked there, so it must have been my teammate who marked that for me. But it's right over the parts I want to get, so... Excuse me, let's just... There we go. And then we can pick our parts up. So six spawns to two. They've only got two lives left. We've got ten left, so we're in a good position here. Even though I have come back from this myself. They've got two of them. They could do something. But it is really game over now. And in the meantime, because I know they're at the top of the map and I'm never going to get there, I just thought I'd pick up my supplies and um, heal myself and see if I can get there, but I don't. And that is actually the game. So thank you very much for watching the video. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Please try out the loadout. It is awesome. And until next time, take care and stay safe. I shall see all of you guys later. Goodbye.